What's going on YouTube? Gias right here. So in today's video, I'm going to show you seven amazing tweaks for iOS 12.0 all the way up to iOS 12.1.2 that you can install with the uncovered jailbreak. So let's get straight into it. The first one is called custom lock and this one allows you to basically configure or change the lock sound. Now this is basically the sound that your device produces when you press the lock button and of course the device locks. Now you have a lot of sounds in here to choose from. Here is a couple of them. And of course you can enable the vibration on lock which will make your device to vibrate when you press a lock button and of course it locks and of course you have to press respring in order to apply the changes. The next one is even more interesting. This one is called badge colors and this one is actually a paid tweak. It's $0.85 and of course this one allows you to basically configure it so that it would change the badge colors or these little circles in here telling you how many notifications you have in an application and they would match the color of the application icon or the icon that has been themed by a Cydia theme. So that's you can see the app store icon is basically blue so the badge is blue the settings one is gray so it took the gray color and if you have for example a red icon it would make the badge red if you have one that is green it would make it green and so on so it changes according to the accent color of the icon which is definitely nice and it does work with themes so it's definitely nice the next one is a free tweak coming from big boss and this one is called video hud it changes the hud for the volume and as you can see it makes it like that which is definitely looking good and in my opinion it's much much better than the full screen one that iOS has and of course you can have it in there in that corner there is no settings you cannot change the way it's positioned or the way it looks like it's a very simple HUD for the volume but it does work fine the next one is called whoops and this one allows you to basically add a delay or a timer before sending an iMessage or a text message now this one can actually prevent a pretty embarrassing situation let me show you what it does for example I have this message in here normally it would send instantly however when I press now I have a delay in here and if I press while the delay is still counting I'm not going to send a message I can basically fix a typo or rewrite it and so on if I change my mind in the last second so if I press again the delay will start again so this is actually very good and you can actually change how long is the delay it says delay time in here and you can go all the way up to 10 seconds and you have to press respring in there so definitely a nice one and it can save you from a very embarrassing situation if you catch a mistake in your message right before it's sent the next one is a pretty common one but some of you probably do not know about it because you remember the anemone so this one is called snowboard and it's a theming platform which is basically an alternative to anemone because anemone is not available on iOS 12 under the uncovered jailbreak so if you want to add any themes to your device you would have to install snowboard which is basically free and it allows you to install themes the same way you did with the anemone and you can see for example I have the themes in here you just drag them enable them and that's basically it and as you can see my device is being themed right now this is a theme and uh, it's called oyster so yeah you can download themes and install them on your device to change the icons and so on with snowboard which as I said is a replacement for the anemone by the way snowboard doesn't drain the battery as much as the anemone would and of course it's compatible with iOS 7 all the way up to iOS 12.1.2 the next one is called folder color and this one allows you to customize the way your folders look like on iOS you can change the folder name color the folder application folder icon and even the folder background so as you can see for the moment I only have a folder background and of course you can change the color in here through this picker and of course if you go back on a folder as you can see if I open the essentials it does have that background now this applies to all the folders on the system and of course as I said you can change various things and they would apply of course in here you have either the default or a color and if you select a color you can pick whatever you want from the picker so yeah that's pretty much it with this one it's pretty nice check it out and the last one is called launchtron now this one is very very useful yes I saved the best for the last so you have three modes in here either disabled selected apps or recent apps and you can configure which applications you want to show you can disable it for specific applications and so on but basically what this allows you to do is to select for example some favorite applications and when you swipe from the right for example it would bring you this menu in here where you can basically choose the application and open it for example if I want to open 
Falza, I press on it, and there we go, I go to Falza. It's a very quick way to switch to applications, and it's very nice because you can configure it to show up from either left, right, or dynamic, which is basically any mode you want. So yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Seven tweaks you should definitely try. They are amazing, in my opinion, and you should definitely check them out. Thanks for watching. Do not forget to subscribe to stay updated. I'm Geosnow, and till the next time, peace out.